Hello, and welcome back to On The Daily. In this episode, I'm going to tell you about a conversation I actually had with a client surrounding investing. People typically invest from a very masculine place or a, it's like a ready, set, go action kind of place. And this energy when investing, I think keeps people stuck in a loop of quick cash, no cash repeat. So I'm going to tell you why in this episode. And I think if you find yourself dancing right now between saying yes to an investment or not, then you should keep listening because this episode will be super valuable for you. Hey friend, welcome to On The Daily. I'm your host, Danielle McCleary, and I am a quantum business coach. I'm the host of this podcast. I'm a multi six figure entrepreneur, co founder, and president of Hype You Media and CEO of Danielle on the Daily Coaching. What I'm really interested in is helping you live a life and have a business that is a full body yes. So, through all of my education and all of my experience, I'm bringing you two episodes a week where I will guide you and give you the tools necessary to scale a massive, sustainable, and sexy business using your intuition, wealth energetics, and human design. What we can call it is business biohacking. So if you're down for that, then I say let's frickin' go. I'm so glad you're here. From Zero to Launch, my signature program in which I teach you how to literally launch a business from beginning to end um, is coming back March 1st for a live round, meaning in addition to the entire course library, you will also get live calls with me where I can review your sales pages. I can audit your copy. I can, um, you know, we can talk pricing. There's a lot of different things that we'll do, but you'll get personalized support as well as the course itself, which is jam packed. It's three months worth of content all about launching a digital business. So if launching a digital business is your goal in 2024, I got you. Let's go. You can click the link in our show notes if you are interested in From Zero to Launch. And my DMs are always open, Danielle underscore on the daily. Okay, investing. (laughs) There are a lot of people that treat investing as a very masculine action. What I mean by that is typically with investments, especially into mentorship. So I'm talking particularly into mentorship and coaching investments. A lot of people that are stuck in this kind of hyper masculine state in their body, which is very fight or flight, it's very like, I need ROI right now. It's like this, it's just this constant like start and stop and go and stop and go and stop energy. And I think the reason for that and why then when we invest from this place, what we do is like, let's say the container is three months long. You're like, okay, I am going to, it's almost like you're a runner pulling up to the blocks. And like when they say, ready, set, go on your market set, go like you, you start, you start sprinting. Like, what can I do? How can we do this? How can we do this? And that energy, when it comes to investing in coaching or mentorship, I think actually keeps us stuck in this like loop of make money really fast to have lose money really fast, make money really fast, lose money really fast. And so when I, really started to kind of tap into that energy because there was a time when I would invest in this program and then I would invest in this program and then I wouldn't finish that program, but I would invest in another program. And it was just this constant, like, I need to be investing. I need to be investing. And if I'm investing, then I need to be like in it long-term all the time, like, you know, all whatever. When I finally decided that I was, I was, I still actually, I, I never stopped investing in coaching programs. Like I still do that. If there's a coach that's coaching on something that I think they're really good at, and I want to hear their perspective, I will purchase a coaching package, a coaching course, some sort of digital course, digital masterclass, whatever it is, I'll purchase that from a coach. But I found a mentor who I really value her opinion. I value the way she built her business. I value the strengths that she has because they are my biggest areas of opportunity. And I really value that. And I don't, I decided I don't want to just have this like six month container where I'm like 
feeling very overwhelmed by like how much we can get done in six months. And is it going to be worth my investment? That is such a masculine energy, which keeps me from actually being able to let my, my fem, the feminine energy body lead the way, which is what is supposed to happen. But the feminine energy body cannot lead unless it has support from masculine structures. And so the investment, the container that I invest my invest my time into, invest my money into, invest my business into, that container is the masculine structure and strategy. But the ease and contentment of being like, you know what? I, I literally told my mentor, I was like, I don't need an end date. Like just like I'm in it for the, I'm in it to win it. And my mentality switched in that moment. So where before it was like, I need to come up with X amount of money to invest in that mentor for that amount of time. Now it's, I pay my mentor this amount every single month. And it's just part of my, it's part of my business expenses. And it's not, it's no longer this, like, you know, we, we want this energetic high. We want our, like we hire coaches and mentors so that we can feel this like adrenaline rush. And when you learn to not do that, and when you just learn that like mentorship is a non-negotiable in your business, it actually like, it kind of becomes boring in a little bit. Like I don't show up to every call my mentor does. I show up to, I would say 90, 6% of them. But if I have like another call with my business or if there's something else I'm doing, like I don't show up to every call. I'm not like in her DMs every single day, like, or in our, our chat every single day. I, there's sometimes I go a week without talking to her. Now my mentor has become my friend. So like we do talk a lot, but it's not always about business. And that energy has really become so just easy for me. And it's such a contentment. And I have this I have this just ease in my body of knowing that I'm I'm locked into long-term mentorship. It's not going anywhere. I have the support. I have the structure, which means now I can really let that wild, divine feminine energy lead. The, the one who births the ideas, the one who's creative, the one who gets to play, the one who, you know, is is just wondering like how big the world can get, right? Like that's the feminine energy body, but it can't lead if it's not set up by masculine structure and support, which is usually the container that you invest in. So I want to tell you like how my business changed when I started invest started investing from a feminine place of we're locking this in long-term, like we're hibernating for the winter. I'm in it to win it. Like I'm not I'm not trying to like prepare myself for a container. I'm literally like, this is just, this is just my mentor. I'm not, I'm not like participating with her because she's coaching on some crazy thing. Like it's really just mentorship. It's the ability to have somebody who's done what I have am doing in my back pocket and get the support I need. I'm building out something really, really big right now, which I promise you, I'm going to tell you soon. I know I've like kind of hinted at this a few times, but don't worry. I'm going to share it soon. I promise. Um, but like having her in my back pocket to like help me build it out and like be able to send her things like when I need to, instead of like feeling this pressure of like, I have to launch something in the next three months because that's how long this container is. You can even like hear it in my voice, like how much more powerful it is to just know that it's there. And this is why I think people take for granted the power of mentorship the power of long-term close proximity mentorship. When I started investing from this place, I immediately made more money. I immediately increased my monthly recurring revenue. Why? Because I treated my investments that way. My investments go on auto pay every single month. There's no end date. It's just what happens. I'm not stressing out before it comes. I'm not like, oh my gosh, how many more months do I have left? No, it's just part of my business, which then a lot gave me the, and I became an energetic match for that kind of money entering my business. So every single month I have, you know, 30, anywhere from, I mean, I think we're up to like close to probably 50 or 60,000 a month of just monthly recurring revenue. That's just there. Like it just comes. I don't have to work any harder for it. I don't have to like strategize for it. It's literally just monthly recurring revenue from clients who are on payment plans in my business, the same way I'm on a payment plan for my, my mentor. Um, that happened pretty quickly because I, I felt what it was like to have it leave my account. So now I'm like very aware of what it feels like entering my account and then business became to like it be it started to feel a lot easier like it just wasn't this like chaotic internal battle of like oh my gosh am i doing this right am i getting the most out of this because it's only this long like 
I don't want to feel like that in my business. I want my business to just feel easy and expansive and growing. And like also without a timeline, right? When you're investing in, in mentorship and coaching from a masculine place, everything has a start and stop. Everything has a timeline. So then you put yourself on this deadline to like be somebody. And we're not supposed to know the, the how. We're not supposed to know the timeline. We are just supposed to put in the put in the effort and put in the discipline and put in the consistency and then let the feminine energy body of just like wonder and joy lead the way. And then the masculine doesn't have to be so stressed all the time. So this is like very much a double lesson in like, A, why you should invest in long-term close proximity mentorship when your business is at a place where you're ready to just make money and have it feel easy. Obviously, if you're just starting a business, no, take from zero to launch my course. But that course is, a, you know, it's 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 kind of like a long term container because it you'll have it forever, and it really does. Like you can take it at your own pace, but it's going to teach you everything you want to know. But no, I don't think when you're first starting out in business, you need a mentor like all the time. A because it's more expensive, and you know, you also want to be smart with your investments. Of course, you want to be investing into the things that are actually going to grow you, and not just the things that like are, you know, that feel kind of risky. Like you want to be smart. And big and, and there's a, there's still, when you get to the point where you take these courses, like for me, it was, I was buying all these courses and I probably wasn't finishing them because there was a moment where I was like, I already know all this. Like I didn't need to buy this course. Like I knew this already. And maybe I didn't know it, how they were saying it, but like, I definitely, I would love to ask like a question to this coach about like my individual situation. And once I started to have those moments more often than not, I knew it was time for mentorship. And then it was just like, well, this is just what we do. This is just who we are. We invest in mentorship and we invest monthly and it's a non-negotiable period. And that feels better in my central nervous system. So you might be ready for it. And if you are ready for it, my masterminds from uh, my mastermind scale to six is for people who are literally like you have a business, you know, you have a business, you're trying to scale to that, like anywhere from like 10 to $100,000 months. Like that is the range that we have inside of this container. And honestly, like it's the best container. If you're trying to move into a place of, I want a relaxed central nervous system that I don't have to put myself on a timeline and a deadline and like a uh, start and stop every single moment. The best news is if you come into scale to six, like I also were doing in-person retreats this year. So starting in April, you get to come to Austin, Texas, and it's included in your, uh, the, the retreat is included in your tuition for scale to six. So not only do you get this like easy contentment with your investments and you get this like quantum leap and huge exponential growth in your business, you also get an in-person retreat. So now's a great time to come into scale to six. And if that's something you want to apply for, you can slide into my DMS on Instagram at Danielle underscore on the daily, or you can go to my website and um, click the work with me tab. And then you can apply through my website as well. Um, Danielle McClary.com, but invest with your feminine energy body. I promise you it's going to feel so much better and you're not going to feel like I didn't get the most out of it. I didn't get the most out of it. You'll stop feeling like that and it will never come up again. And with that, I will see you in the next episode. Bye.